Hey everyone, this is Nicola from Axe Angel C, and today we do not have another Micro Sky Hunter review. In fact, we have a review of a stabilization system. It's the Volantix X Pilot Flight Stabilizer. It's not an autopilot, it just has an uh, auto level and a gyro to stabilize flight. It's a cheap little neat unit, you can see it right there. Top right corner has potentiometers to adjust uh, gains. On the left is the calibration switch. Uh, you have a number of LEDs to help you know the status of the flight controller, calibration program, etc. And at the bottom you have on the left the output pins, on the right the input pins. And what's different on this one is that it has an SBUS input. So if your receiver has an SBUS out port, you can just connect one cable and be done with it. Otherwise, a, a single cable, a, a batch of single cables is provided. So you can connect up to eight channels, up to eight separate channels via those uh, right there on the side. The manual that comes with the flight controller is in English, as you would expect, but you can get the job done it's not that difficult i was able to set it up fairly easily so i think most of you will uh, be able to handle it if not shortly i am thinking of making a set of videos so uh make sure you uh, look out for my on my uh, youtube channel for that right here you can see i've uh, already connected everything the elevator the ailerons the uh, throttle is already connected in there this plane has no rudder so i'm not going to be using that and now we get to move on to flight stabilizer is in the plane around the cg point and uh, right now you can see me verifying that it's working make sure you do this check that it's working in the proper direction that it's stabilizing the plane not destabilizing it so it should move counter to the direction you're tilting the plane so with all the tests done it's time to go and see what this little baby can do uh, you can see my uh, shirt flapping and you will see some trees now it was quite a windy day for a plane that small look at that and uh, i have to say the plane itself did perform quite well and the flight stabilizer did perform even better this is the result of flying in full manual without stabilization on as you can see not optimal although the plane does handle it rather well i have seen worse worse performances but this is rather rather good but still flying fpv with something that's been knocked around in the sky so much and let's face it i may want to fly on a windy day i i just can't afford to wait only for the calm ones and once you switch on the flight stabilizer this is the result you can see it's a big difference the wind is uh not gone it's still there you can see it actually gusting because the plane is sort of you know being nudged around and nudged and bopped but the flight stabilizer really does a very good job of stabilizing the plane i was really surprised now it has two three modes actually one is the stabilization is off and two different rates or something but I flew in both of them and I have to say I was not able to differentiate between the two. Uh, the, the planes seem to behave exactly the same so I'll have to look into that and see what the difference is between these two modes. But seriously, very, very good performance. Keep in mind it is probably over 10 meters a second right now uh really high wind this day and uh look at that this is a 380 gram plane now flying as if it's a perfect day and uh, you can see here no throttle full elevator with the stabilization on and just it just parachutes down look at that wings level it's perfect same situation no stabilization 
look at that left and right it doesn't go into the death spiral but it's a you know it's a handful to keep that and look stabilization on perfectly level flight in that wind looking really nice and you can actually land that way don't use full throttle full elevator pull the throttle down and just parachute it and glide it in look at that so nice and so easy and you don't have to worry about tip stalls because this plane doesn't tip stall and the uh, flight stabilizer does a really good job of keeping the wings level even at low speeds look at that and i can only imagine what it would do on a larger plane and uh, not something so small so like i said follow my youtube channel i will have a set of videos soon enough and i will have to say goodbye now and i will see you later